Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. So on today's video, I will be sharing with all of you yung feeding essentials ng aking baby. Ito yung mga items that I am using right now in preparing his food and at the same time in feeding him. I know na yung pag-offer ng solid food sa ating mga babies ay isa sa mga milestones na sobrang excited tayong mga mommies. Kaya naman apart from planning ko ano yung first food na offer natin sa kanila, excited din tayo mag-shopping ng mga items na gagamitin natin in feeding them. So, my baby turned 6 months old last August and doon na rin ako nag-start mag-introduce ng solid food sa kanya. So, right now, ito yung mga items na ginagamit ko in feeding him. So, the first on my list are these um, feeding bowls from Munchkin. It comes in a set of three na. And what I like about this one is it comes in different um, sizes and at the same time in different colors. Meron din siyang suction sa ilalim. I also have um, this plate na meron na din siyang divider which is good kapag mas marami ng variety yung kinakain ni baby. Meron na rin siyang suction sa ilalim para nagsistick siya sa table. So, if ever na malikot si baby while eating, hindi siya matatanggal. So, next are um, these feeding spoons. So, I have a lot. Pero kadalasan na ginagamit ko is this one. Kasi what I like about this is once na dinip mo siya sa something na hot or mainit, nag-iiba yung color niya. So, alam mo kung mainit pa yung food na ino-offer mo kay baby. I also have um, these utensils na meron na siyang cover which um, I'm planning to use if ever man nalalabas kami. So next on the list is of course a sippy cup. So this is the one that I have from Avent. Although right now hindi ko siya masyadong ginagamit pa dahil ang ginagamit ko to let my baby drink is itong cover ng kanyang baby bottle. Dahil medyo mahirap pa talaga siyang painamin ng water right now. Next on the list are bibs. So, I have a lot. Meron ako ng ganitong bib na simple white lang. Meron din ako ng ganitong colorful bib. And then, I also have yung mga ganitong may design na bib na may parang plastic sa likod so hindi mababasa si baby. And then, I also have this silicone bib na merong pocket na din siya. And then, I also have itong parang plastic na ayan, may pocket din. And also, I have ito, yung Superman na binili ko for my baby kasi nakutan lang ako talaga sa kanya. So, included on my list is this baby fruit feeder na ang brand niya ay Nature Bond. So, I am not sure guys if available siya dito sa Pilipinas dahil ito ay gift lang sa aking baby. So, this one comes with a silicone teeth like this kung saan nyo ilalagay yung mga fruits na ipapakain kay baby. So, I'm going to try to open it para mas makita ninyo. So, ayan, ganyan. Removable yung silicone teeth niya. And doon nyo ilalagay yung mga fruits na kinat ninyo na ipapakain ninyo kay baby. So, I'm going to close it one now. Ayan. This one comes in three different sizes then And yung gagamitin nyo is based dun sa age ng inyong baby. So next on my list are the storage containers which I use in storing the food of my baby. Kadalasan kasi talaga in bulk ako nagpe-prepare. So meron ako nitong um, glass and then I also have itong mga lock and lock plastic kapag ilalagay sa freezer yung food. And then ito another glass kapag lang sa mga ref ganyan. So um... Meron talagang nabibili na pang store ng mga baby food. Kaya lang, ito yung napili ko for practical reasons. Kasi tingin ko, mas uh, madami akong paggagamitan sa kanya in the future kapag natapos na si baby dun sa feeding stage like this. So, ito yung sample ng mga food na pinaprepare ko in bulk. Next on my list is a high chair and we are using this mama's and papa's high chair. And what I like about this one is first, adjustable yung height niya. 
Second is may cushion yung sandalan, kaya super comfy si baby kapag kumakain. And adjustable din by the way yung sandalan niya. And also, very well protected si baby dahil maayos yung kanyang seatbelt. And then, um, yung kanyang detachable na table, super wide din. And adjustable din siya. Kaya yan, maganda yung experience ni baby every time na kumakain siya. Next on my list is this hand blender, which I use ka every time na magpapure ako ng food ni baby. Although right now, bihira ko siyang gamitin dahil mas preferred kong magbigay ng mashed food sa aking baby. Um, pero kung gusto niyo magpure, isa ito sa mga magagandang device to use. So, the last on my list is itong fork or tinidor. So, every time na magmamash ako ng food ni baby, eto na talaga yung ginagamit ko. Dahil apart from effective naman siya in mashing the food, eh mas madali rin siyang linisin. Kaya naman kung mash lang and no need naman na to puree, mas gusto ko na talaga yung tinidor na lang yung ginagamit as compared to mga blenders. So, those are the items that I am currently using in feeding my baby. Actually, karamihan dun sa mga pinakita ko is um, items pa na ginamit nung aking second son na si Cleo. Dahil um, two years lang yung gap nila ni baby Miko ko. Kaya nung nakita ko na very usable pa naman yung mga items, yun na rin yung pinagamit ko sa aking baby Miko. And most of those items were actually bought from Qatar pa dahil dun kami nagre-reside before. Pero I know naman na may mga nahahawig na ganong items na pwede nyo rin mabili dito sa Pilipinas. So, I guess that's it guys. Um, if there are any item na ginagamit ninyo in feeding your babies na hindi ko nabanggit on this video, just let me know on the comment section below. Dahil, may maka, dahil baka may mga gamit na kailangan in feeding our babies na namimiss out ko. So, thank you so much for watching and I hope that you will subscribe to the channel. See you on the next vlog. Bye!